What's up there, Dimmaduelist? I'm Doug Dimmadome, owner of the Dimsdale Dimmadome. We out here talking about some Dimmaduelist stuff for the Yu-Gi-Oh! World Championships 2017. Uh, about five or six hours ago, I guess this was posted on the UK page. Uh, but it's pretty much been on Facebook. I, I woke up this morning and I saw it. So a lot of people sharing, a lot of people talking about it. Uh, so I want to give a quick shout out to the Italian Yu-Gi-Oh! page actually for being the first page that I saw it on. Uh, if you guys don't know, uh, the Yu-Gi-Oh! World Championship for 2017 was actually announced. Uh, their official location uh, says that it's coming to London, baby. Um, it's like it's like Fast and Furious 6 over here. We're coming to London, baby. So I'm actually really excited for this. I've uh, you know I, I'm gonna do my best this year. Hopefully, I can uh, make it to the uh, to the uh, North American World Championship qualifier this year. Last year was actually the first year I didn't attend it. Uh, this year. Uh, I actually might be in Europe during that time regardless, so I don't know. We'll see. Maybe I'll go there. Maybe I won't. Uh, I don't know. We'll, we'll see. Uh, depends if I can act, even make it to the North American World Championship qualifier, and depends how I do there, so uh, we'll see. But it says on August tw uh, 12th and 13th, the world's top duelists will gather in London, uh, the UK, for the 2017 Yu-Gi-Oh! Trading Card Game World Championships. Uh, so, and it has all the details for all the different finalists, so th there'll be two finalists from the 2017 World Championship Qualifier European Championship, so basically Euros, uh, they'll automatically qualify, as well as two finalists from the 2017 WCQ from Oceanics, and then they'll have four additional spots uh, for, for top-ranked players ac across Europe, and then we'll have people from Germany, France, Italy, the UK, one from each country, uh, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And then it just it just has all the other different people that will be participating. Uh, it's a really fun event. I, I'm obviously like, I, I haven't planned to go to, to London to Worlds or anything like that yet. But uh, if any of you guys are in the UK or anything like that and are considering going, even if you're not necessarily going to be, if you don't perform well at your uh, qualifier to actually make it to Worlds, uh, I highly, highly encourage you guys to go. Um, I've, I've only been to London once in my life and that was on a layover many, many, many years ago. And I'd really love to go again, so I don't know. Maybe you guys will see me there. Maybe you guys won't, but um, I, I would love to go to this. It just I, I can only imagine uh, what London is like right now after all these years. So um, just a quick info update for you guys. Um, also, for those of you guys that don't know, there's a ton of side events. I actually went to Worlds in 2013. Uh, it was in Las Vegas and Nevada, and it was a really fun time. There's a ton of side events, even if you're not participating in the main event. Uh, there's just a ton of side events you guys can do. I'm sure you guys can read up on that. I think it even says here, yeah, it says, please note that this will be a closed tournament for invited players only, but the uh, and that the event won't be open to the general public, but we will be hosting a public events or have a spectating area on site. So they're going to be having public events just like every other world. Uh, it's just going to be a lot of fun. You guys can do like Winamats, box tournaments, structure deck events. There'll probably be like regional flights for the following year. There's a ton of fun stuff. So you guys should definitely consider going if you guys have the opportunity to go. Um, I, I always encourage Yu-Gi-Oh! players that haven't actually attended a Yu-Gi-Oh! World Championship, whether it is being directly part of the main event or just uh, to attend the event itself for public events and to hang out and to see what it's like to actually go and do that at least once in their Yu-Gi-Oh! career just because it's uh, it's such a different, surreal experience. You actually can feel like, it act, even if you're not participating, I, I've just you feel the prestige in the air. You feel just how tense the competition is there. Um, and it's just an awesome event. It's very uh, it's very exciting, and I highly recommend you guys go if you guys are in London. I know um, if there's some, by some stretch of the imagination, I'm able to either make it and participate in the main event or just go to the event itself, I would gladly do so, but um, it is in London, so um, it's definitely a long shot. But um, yeah, that's really it. Just wanted to give you guys an update. I'll link this page down below. This is actually the UK news page. Um, all the additional news, I'm sure, will be posted. Uh, they'll have, you know, all the... Um, the, the, if you actually click here on World Championship Qualifiers, it tells you all the additional information for all the different countries. So all, all the different countries that are having uh, qualifiers, especially stuff for like Euros and stuff. Euros and in Europe and everything over there is just a lot more complicated than it is for the U.S. Here, we just got to um, do well at regionals or YCS and then we can go to world, uh, nationals for us or the uh, North American World Championship Qualifier. And then if you do well at that, you go to Worlds. But in Europe, it's a little bit different. You got to do well in your own country. Then you got to go to Euros. And then from there, you got to go to the World Championship Qualifier or uh, the World uh, Championship itself. So it's a little bit different, but you guys can read up on all that if you guys ever want more information. Uh, again, this is the UK page. So it's a little bit different than our page here for the for the US uh, as well as the rest of the TCG. So uh, yeah, be sure to check this out. I'll link it for you guys down below. But man, 
Yu-Gi-Oh! Worlds is going to London. That's really exciting. The last time it was in Europe, I believe, was a couple years ago when, um, or like three years ago when it was in Italy. So, um, yeah, it's pretty exciting uh, stuff. So, yeah, check it out. See you guys. Take it easy. Enjoy your day, Dimaduelist. And uh, hopefully I'll have a couple more videos up today. I do plan on doing a, uh, a burn deck profile. And if I get the last couple cards, I got the majority of the cards in for the Gear Gear deck. It's just I want to wait on the last, like, three cards. I don't want to do use common gear gear gears for the deck profile. I really want to use supers, so hopefully I can get those in the mail today. But um, yeah, check you guys out later. Take it easy, and uh, that's just a quick update for you guys.